Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back to Melinda's Messy Sink. In today's video, we will be making an appetizer that I absolutely love that's full of fresh ingredients. We will be making bruschetta. This video is in collaboration with Ann from What's Up Family Home. I will have Ann from What's Up Family Home's channel listed in the description box below. Today's video is all about thanking our farmers and their families for all of their hard work that allows uh, food to be on my family's table. Now let's get into the bruschetta. So today we are going to make bruschetta. I found these recipes online that I'm going to make today and I'll make sure that the original recipe link is in the description box below. So we have a baguette and the first part we're going to do is cut thin slices. That was a workout. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is we are going to place our slices of baguette on a cookie sheet. So the recipe says for us to drizzle some olive oil on each slice. The recipe says to salt and pepper this side of your baguette. I also have my oven on the broil setting heating up. Next, we're gonna flip these over and repeat the same steps. I have finished salting and peppering this side as well. The recipe wants us to broil these for one to two minutes on both sides until toasted. Our bread is toasted on both sides. I'm gonna let it sit here and cool. And now we are going to combine our ingredients. While the bread was going and we were on a little break, I went ahead and cut up our tomatoes. I'll make sure I have the recipe in the description box below. Onions, I did not put as many onions in as the recipe called for. I'm not a big fan of onions. Olive oil, garlic. In here I have salt, pepper, and basil. And then I have Parmesan cheese. We are gonna give this a good stir and get all those spices um, and the cheese and the olive oil all combined. And this is what my bruschetta looks like. And here is our finished plate of bruschetta. The um, baguette, I put those in a Ziploc bag to stay fresh. The bruschetta, the leftovers, I've put that into a refrigerator safe container. It will last about three days. Wanted to show you how delicious this is and all of the fresh ingredients. Garden tomatoes are so, so good. Wanted to thank you guys so much for joining along with me today as I made bruschetta. These are great for parties as appetizers. These are great just for a snack um, if you've got some extra tomatoes that you need to use up. Also wanted to thank those farmers again and their families for putting food on our tables and thank you if you have a garden yourself. Thank you if you are host farmers markets and thank you if you shop at our farmers markets to support our local farmers. Don't forget to check out the description box below with the plan from What's Up Family Homes um, link to her channel. She does all kinds of gardening, canning, um, DIY, cooking great recipes. You'll just love Anne. Don't forget, Jesus loves you. I'll see you in the next one.